Macintosh built. In this video, we're going to work on uh, what exactly we need to do to load the software uh, by downloading iBoot, uh, using your retail copy of Snow Leopard, and then uh, downloading MultiBeast that'll help set up the system once we have it up and running. First thing we're going to do is enter setup. Advanced BIOS features. Make sure it's booting off the CD-ROM. Integrated peripherals. Change the SATA AHCI mode to AHCI. management. Make sure that the ACPI suspend mode is an S3. HPET support is enabled and HPET mode is 32-bit. Once you make those changes, hit F10. Save to CMOS and exit. Put the iBoot CD in the drive. Okay, then you'll come up to this screen. Now you'll eject your CD. Load your Snow Leopard uh, DVD into the drive. Wait for the DVD ROM drive to shut down. A little green light will come off of it. Then press F5. And Mac OS X install DVD will come up. course we are going to select English next now you'll notice there is no disk here because we have a blank hard drive in the the bay So we'll go to Utilities, Disk Utility, since this is a 2 terabyte drive and uh, the, inst the uh, bootloader doesn't like anything over a 1 terabyte drive, we're going to partition this hard drive off into three partitions. The first one we'll call Hackintosh. The second one I'll call Apple to plus and this one I'll call Apple to E. Kind of an homage to the uh, old Apple systems. Now let's take a look at our um, options on these. We want to use um, the guild partition table. We'll call this one extended. The 
this one Mac OS extended as well. Let's look at the options on this as well. It's also Guild. It's also Guild. That should be everything we need to do right there. We'll apply. Tell it yes. When we're done with this, we can close it off. Now it asks which partition we want to install uh, Mac OS X in. We're going to put it there. Okay, now to restart the computer. We'll need to put iBoot in the drive. Right, if we've done everything correctly, boot into the Hackintosh and we should get the video. up and running. Now we have a few things we'll need to do. And that is we need to do the combo update. And then we also need the multi beast. The Snow Leopard Edition. And that should be downloading as well. You can check on it, go on there. Or of course you can pull up your download window. When the download completes, uh, Finder will pop up with the update combo package. Before you click on that, you'll want to open the multi-beast. Just leave it open in the corner. Now install your update. <laughs> Type in your password. The installer will take a few minutes to come up. Continue the installation. Okay, do not restart your computer. Now we go into Multi Beast. Okay, Easy Beast install. Miscellaneous. What's the NVIDIA plugin? And then we'll continue with our install. And of course. Reopen it if it does that. We'll do it in any way. Texts, audio. Okay, 
what I'm doing is I'm basically customizing my install to what I have in my motherboard and my graphics card and my network. This here is utility programs that help. So I'm going to install it all. Punch in our install password, hit OK, and it should come up and start working. Now if everything's gone right, we can reboot the system and it'll come back up. Wish me luck. And there you go. Now you can set your Mac up as you please.